To Be Continued Productions proudly presents Living Off Campus at Arizona State University. Freshman, don't be like this guy. Choose your living situation for next year wisely. It's an important decision that will affect you for your next three years here at ASU. Arizona State University, Tempe campus, home to 70% of you. And for a majority of you, you live in either one of these four locations on campus. For those unfamiliar, here's a quick glance. If you're like the 47,308 students at Arizona State, you're most likely going to move off campus after freshman year. And moving off campus is a huge change for many of you. This will be the first time you're on your own with really no one looking over your shoulder. This is a big responsibility. The first thing you want to do is get an idea of someone you want to live with. If you're the type that can't study while this is going on, then you probably shouldn't choose roommates who like to do this. Because then, that will eventually lead to this. Yeah, you're not going to talk to me like that. No, no. You're not going to talk to no. me like that. I no, no. I'll put no. your head through the window. <laughs> hey. Now that's not very nice. Come on. You don't want to struggle your sophomore year. And you certainly don't want to upset your parents. So do you and your parents a favor and pick a roommate who you share common interests with. Once you have an idea of who your roommate's going to be, Think about how you're going to get to campus. If you plan to drive, that's great. If not, you have to factor that in. I mean, at this time, many of you freshmen most likely want to stay close to campus. And that either means walking, biking, or the orbit bus. So once you've figured out your means of transportation, you should start looking for a place to live. If you want a little peace and quiet with some space, I suggest living in a house near the west end of campus. This area is close and it offers a variety of college housing. If you feel that a house or condo is not for you, then try looking for an apartment near the south end of campus. As the virtual tour starts, you notice the numerous college apartments. This is also a great area because you can either bike or walk to campus. So the view, though, if you're going to pay the price of the view, you might as well get a condo behind Mill. The condos near Mill are a prime location for anyone who is seeking space and privacy, but also wants to go to Mill every now and then. Some of the condos offer garages, like this. Some offer great views. And some are just straight ballin'. So now that you've seen the options for off-campus housing, remember, choose your roommates wisely, think about your transportation, then focus on your location and price range because a happy home equals a happy student and a happy student equals good grades. <laughs>